Hello. I always thought it'd be fun to put a, an informational video on YouTube about vintage Fender amps. Over the last couple of years, I've collected several, and there's not that many video clips of actual vintage amps on YouTube. It, uh, the ones that I've got, uh, the 59 Bandmaster with the 310s or a 1960 Tweed Bassman. And I thought it'd be uh, informational to put uh, these sound clips on YouTube, help you guys to decide if you ever wanted to buy a vintage amp, give you some of my tips that I've learned over the last couple of years. So I'm by no means an expert, but I've definitely learned a lot over the last two years. I've had to learn how to maintain these tube amps, how to check tubes, how to buy tubes. Uh, how to baby them, how to give them a lot of love because they need it. Uh, once you get them going, they're, they're, they're still running as strong as they were uh, 50 years ago. But uh, I just wanted to keep your interest. I'm going to show you uh, the 59 Bandmaster here real quick. Uh, if, if you're interested in vintage amps, uh, the Soul of Tone, the last uh, or celebrating 60 years this is a great book actually this bandmaster I purchased from one of the big collectors that provided most of the amps in this book you can see there's a basement right there but uh, Perry Tate big collector I, I just by chance bought one of his amps back in 2007 and I use it I gig with these amps in New Orleans I play in a blues band so these have all been out in in club situations so I have an idea of how, what they can handle what they can't handle so stick with me come back to part one and I'll split it up in probably about four parts but I'll uh, right now I'm gonna turn the camera off and I'm gonna come back and show you the insides of the 59 Bandmaster